Yeah, yeah, he was a role, he was a scholar, athlete at Villanova. We always extol his virtues and his sagacity for the game. Seven games above the 500 mark. And the Pelicans lost in Toronto, so they're looking for revenge. Ingles. Here's Richardson in and out, rebounded by Barrett. Pelicans not a good three-point shooting team, only averaged 10 threes a game, and the league average is 12. Barrett works his way inside, puts it up in the left hand, gets the roll, and the foul. Barrett had been playing with the second unit. Did not see much action last night in the fourth quarter. In fact, the Bibbies are one of five father-son tandems to play for the Knicks. Of course, the Brunsons, the newest addition. Robinson slams it home. Henry Bibby drafted by the Knicks in 72. Jerry Lucas came over in 71 of the trade for Cassie Russell. Randall wide open. Knocks down a three. And you can see a lot of Red Hostman. I see a lot of Red Hostman in his coaching style. No nonsense. Teamwork. Defense. Brunson. Giving us a dinner, so. Nice weekend. <laughs> Busy weekend for the 1973 squad. Here's Barrett from three. Four. Barrett. RJ also has been feasting there behind the arc. Knicks with nine threes. Seven for ten from inside the arc. Yep, made that big three ball from the corner. Nice garden debut last year when he scored, scored 13 off the bench. He was among the rookie leaders last season. The Rising Stars game, so I asked him what it was going to be like to go up and compete against him tonight. And he told me that there was going to be some bragging rights on the line because, of course, Alvarado took home that MVP. First meeting of the season between the Knicks and Pelicans. Here's Barrett. And it's an offensive foul as Richardson hit the floor. Yeah, Barrett overzealous with the shovel. Upped his game to that level. That's why he's been frequently traded. Now in his eighth season, his sixth different club, Robinson. Just over seven minutes remaining, second quarter. Here's Barrett. Battle for the rebound. Ingram pulls it down. Here's Ingram. He's missed his last seven from the field. 15 feet away this time, coming up short. Oh, for his last eight. Ceremony coming up at halftime, honoring the golden anniversary of the Knicks championship back in 1973. Brunson cross court. Here's Barrett from three. RJ Barrett with his second three point field goal. Time winding down. Here's Barrett, very apropos, 73 points at the half. Great to see so many of your former teammates yeah, yeah. out on the court, as well as Knicks from some more recent eras. Knicks with the 73 first half points, very apropos. Yeah, right on time, let's we'll see now. Randall was the catalyst, getting them off four consecutive threes. Randall with 46 last night. That matched a career high. Here's Barrett. Here's Randall. Grimes driving baseline. Back out for Barrett, who lays it in. In the fourth quarter, the Knicks would score 19 consecutive points. The last five minutes, 11 seconds. And while that was noteworthy, another three ball by... McCullough and Ingram, their two top guns, continue to misfire. Barrett double dribble that time. Pitched the no-hitter back in, guess what year? 1973. <laughs> that was a terrific year for the Bibby family. You release that thing that is going in. That's half the battle. Time winding down. Here's Barrett, strong move to the hoop. To get your tickets today, join us for a legendary night. For the most passionate fans on Tuesday, February 28th at Tau Downtown. It's been very aggressive tonight getting into the paint. So three or three from the line looking for two more. Barrett needed this game, Kenny. He had been struggling since uh, the All-Star break last night. So finally. Hall of Fame players. Wow. Well deserved. That is the record. Played 12 years in the NBA. 
Pelicans made it to the playoffs last season. The alley oop from Barrett for Robinson. Quickly back the other way. Into the poor shot selection by the Pelicans. RJ Barrett. The first time this season. Rose all smiles. Shot is short. Hartenstein puts it in. And the Knicks have won their fifth consecutive game.